Happy, happy Father's Day. Hey, I thought we would make a fun recipe today that the kids could help make and enjoy too. Stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel. I'm so happy you're here today because when we eat well, we feel better. And when we feel better, we do better. So with that in mind, today we're going to be making cacao peanut butter oat drop cookies. Let's begin today by adding one half of a cup of natural creamy peanut butter to a medium sized pot. Now feel free to substitute this with whatever nut or seed butter works best for you. For our sweetener today, I am going to add one quarter cup of pure maple syrup. You certainly could use honey, agave, date syrup, or even Lakanto maple syrup, which is a low glycemic sweetener. So always make these recipes work for you and your diet. Next, I'm going to add in one quarter of a cup of coconut oil. You could also use grass-fed butter or ghee. This will add some nice healthy fats to our recipe. Over medium low heat, melt and stir all of your ingredients together until you reach a nice, smooth, even texture. So typically when you make this type of cookie with granulated sugar, you heat it longer to dissolve the sugar. But since we are using maple syrup, you just want the ingredients to smooth out and come together. Remove from the heat and then transfer into a mixing bowl. Now we are ready to add in two and a half tablespoons of cacao or cocoa powder. You could definitely use cacao powder here because our mixture is not boiling. It might be a little bit warm and if you want, just let it cool off a little bit before you add the chocolate in. And then all of those wonderful nutrients will still be intact. Next, I'm going to add in two scoops of our clean sourced collagens powder for some digestive, joint, skin, hair, nail, teeth, bone support. Next, I'm going to add in one tablespoon of ground flaxseed. I love sneaking in healthy ingredients to recipes that no one will know, but your body definitely will. For a little bit of spice today, I'm going to add in one half of a teaspoon of Ceylon cinnamon and one quarter of a teaspoon of pink Himalayan sea salt. Pink Himalayan or sea salt. For flavor, I have one teaspoon of pure vanilla extract. Stir together all of your ingredients. Next, let's add in one and one quarter cups of gluten-free rolled oats. Last, any optional add-ins. I'm going to add two tablespoons of mini chocolate chips. Some other options are shredded coconut, chopped nuts, dried fruit, and even some cayenne pepper for a little bit of spice. Give everything one last good stir. And now drop onto either a parchment or wax paper lined baking sheet. I'm using a one and a half tablespoon cookie dough scooper to make this easy, but a good old spoon works perfectly too. Place your cookies in the refrigerator to harden until you are ready to enjoy. These cookies are ready to give a taste. So let's see. These are chocolatey, chewy, peanut buttery, perfectly sweet goodness. <laughs> Give these ones a try, you cannot go wrong. Thanks so much for joining me today. From all of us here at Organics, we are wishing you a happy, happy Father's Day. I look forward to seeing you next week in the kitchen. Bye-bye.